The name of our company is Applied Genetic Technologies Corporation, or AGTC for short, as we call ourselves. And what we're doing is developing new products for patients with critical unmet needs in the areas of ophthalmology. So a lot of people go blind in their lives because they have genetic deficiencies. And what our products do is deliver to those patients the correct genetic material they need to produce the missing proteins and so improve their vision. So many people are ill, not because because of a disease they acquire, but because of the genes they have, and that genetic defect causes them to be ill. So what we're producing is a treatment that provides to that person the correct genetic material so their own body can help them feel better. The interplay of the delivery vehicle, the design of the genetic material, and then the physical delivery of that material to the patient's body. And these things are all very critical, and that's the core competency that our company brings to the table. One of the great foundations of our company and how it gets started was our five scientific founders who really run the gamut from virologists to clinicians to medical doctors and they understand not just the technology but the clinical indications that we're trying to address and help patients. And so that all started as a spin out from the University of Florida where we licensed our original technology. So I get a lot of questions from my peers in the life science industries about what it's like to grow a company in Florida and I tell all of them that the opportunities here are very rich the cost of living is low the cost of doing business is low we here in the Florida high-tech corridor um, area have access to a huge amount of talent at the universities like University of Florida University of South Florida University of Central Florida and it's a great place to grow a business so I guess there are really two things that I would hope our company contributes to the future of the industry. One is to show that a small company from modest beginnings can really be successful in pushing products forward all the way into commercialization. And the second revolves around our technology. Our technology, which really gets at the genetic cause of the disease, can be life-changing and industry-changing, and it's a whole new paradigm of how to treat patients, in that one treatment could cure that genetic deficiency and provide long-lasting benefit for the patients.